so guys now we are going to perform drag and drop okay so let's find uh, okay yep so we are going to perform drag and drop so first of all obviously we have to import these uh, action chains uh, after importing the web driver so i'm going to this split the screen yeah now i'm going to run this first cell yeah perfect so we imported this action chains right so yeah now i'll just show you a demo so you can see this is a website seleniumeasy.com slash taste lacks drag and drop demo so uh, these are the items which uh, you should drag okay to over here okay so let's see what's happened if you drag it over here you can see uh, it added in the dropped item list and now it is removed from here right similarly if you uh, drag this one it will add it over here and it will be removed from here right so we will perform this thing using selenium okay so first of all obviously we need to open that particular site so i'll just copy uh, this one and paste it over here yeah perfect so after uh okay i need to change the link i'll copy the link and paste it over here okay now we are going to wait for three seconds so that the page loads properly and after that we are going to uh drag this item right so first of all i'll just write over here source element okay because uh, we are going to uh drag this one to over here so this is the source and this is the target right so uh, source element will be equals to driver dot find element by x path so i'll just copy this one paste it over here and inside this we are going to uh paste the x path of this particular item so because we are going to drag the first one first of all so i'll just right click on it go into inspect and copy the x path from here okay perfect so i'll just paste it over here and i need to change it with single quotation okay and now we are going to write target element okay again i am going to copy this driver dot find element by x path paste it over here and now we have to write uh, the x path of this particular uh, section right so you can see this is a div id drop zone equals to move so i'll just copy the section x path yeah perfect i'm going to paste it over here change it with single quotation okay so now we are going to call this action chains right so i'll just copy it from here actions equals to action chains driver and then we are going to perform the drag and drop operation right so i'll just write over here actions dot drag underscore and underscore drop okay so this is the method drag and drop and in the parenthesis first of all it takes the source element so i'm just writing source element then comma then we have to write the second argument that is target element okay that's it and then obviously we need to write dot perform because you already learned whenever using some actions you have to write dot perform at the end of the line okay see you can see over here we uh, wrote this dot perform over here similarly we do dot perform over here as well so i'm going to write dot perform perfect so yeah that's it so let's run this cell and see whether it is working or not you can see it open this automated browser and it is loading with that particular page okay now it should actually drag the one uh, well it is taking a long time i think i did some mistake so uh yeah you can see it ran properly but uh the drag draggable one is not drag over here it is not in this list right so i think there is a mistake let's see so to debug what's the problem over here because you already opened this particular window so i'm going to split it over here so that i don't need to open it again yeah so let's run this cell and see what's wrong over here mm. okay so i'm going to run this cell okay it is taking a long time well it is not working and it is also not showing any kind of error well i guess uh it is actually not showing any kind of error so the syntax is actually correct but there is some problem with this particular website so i'm going to open some new website for example the second one okay 
So in the second one, you can see this, there is a blue circle and you have to drag it over this big circle, right? So let's reload this page and let's do that. Okay, so I, I'm going to change the link uh, with this link, copy and paste it over here. And also I need to merge the above cell so that I need to run only uh, one time. Yeah, perfect. And then I just need to find the XPath of this small circle, copy the XPath. Since we already wrote the syntax, we don't need to waste many time. Paste it and change it with single quotation. Perfect. And now we need to uh, copy the XPath of the target area. That means this one. Copy and copy the XPath. Paste it over here. Change it with single quotation. Well, perfect. So let's run this cell and see whether it is working or not. So you can see it open this automated browser. Now it should load that particular page. And it, it should move that blue circle to the big circle, right? So you can see it is taking some time to load up properly. Yeah, now you can see the blue circle is dragged to that big circle and it is showing you did great. So in this way, you can use this drag and drop method. Okay, It takes two arguments. The first one is the source element. The second one is the target element. Okay, that's it.